Okay guys, so we're looking here at Shopify, that's S-H-O-P, and it is one of my favorite stocks to trade. It's extremely volatile, it can move so fast, and when you can get in at a decent entry point, this the contracts are not even that unaffordable. Now everybody tries to shy away from the options on Shop um, because the bid and ask spread can be kind of wide, but if you can get in before the volatility even starts to shake up, you can get it at a pretty good price, and sometimes you can get in on a discount. So looking here at shop, it still has plenty of room to run up here. Um, it's close to breaking out. We just need it to get above this high of uh, 1044 and it's going to run to 1100. And obviously I think it's going to hit that uh, 1200 mark quicker than you actually think because Shopify, once it actually does start to move, once it does break out, it makes a considerable run. It's going to break out here on the longer term time frame and you know it almost resembles AMD on the yearly chart because this is just one big bull flag guys and I've been trading this thing since it was I think around $85 and you know I had a price target 150 and then that 150 price target turned to 500 and that 500 turned to a thousand and now I think shop is gonna be worth at least 2,000 by the end of 2021 so that's my prediction um, it's gonna be close to it, around 8 1500 most likely um, so once this breaks out we can run to 1500 within months so the if you're just trying to day trade this or swing trade it um, this is definitely should be on your watch list over the next few weeks because we're too close to this resistance line to not try and retest the highs of uh, 1070 and even if you're just day trading you know that's a that's a $40 move and that's gonna net you at least a hundred percent profit if you're trading options um, but what are you going to do in the meantime for next week? So we have essentially Shopify coming down and testing back on this trend line. That would, that's what I would want to have happen if I'm trying to get in. This 13 EMA on the one hour chart seems like it's going to finish pretty flat and give us an entry point somewhere around 1025. It's currently sitting around 1033, so don't just jump in right away. Um, you might even be able to, might even trade flat and break out um, on Tuesday, 9 so this would probably give a, a nice breakout to that 1,105 level that I was talking about. And it's coming down, the RSI is cooling off, and I see this MACD crossing uh, down and diverging. So I can see a cool down happening, and that's perfect because that's what we want to get a good entry point to make this nice swing trade. So guys, let me know what you guys think about Shopify. Um, what, do you, what are your entries? What are your exits? And you know, let's see what those profit targets are because this thing can really move upwards and be bullish. And I'm really happy to, to be already in it. So let me know what you guys think. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you have any more questions or concerns, feel free to drop a comment down below and we'll get right back to you. But if you want a more immediate response, just join the chat room. We'll get back to you right away. All you have to do is go to tacticaltraders.com, scroll down, hit the link for the free trial, and you'll be in the chat room in no time. But if you already make the move to join the chat room, there's a 50% Black Friday deal that's going to the end of the month and we'll get you guys in trading in no time. But until next time, stay on target.